Next tool, this is quite good for changing annotations within the DWG or DXF. Say for instance you put, like on this example here, all of the numbering conventions start with B, B101, B101-2. If you wanted to change that to A, what you could do is actually search and say, right, anything with A in front of it, I want to swap that and replace it with B. So you can just change it around. So rather than chasing around, picking every annotation and manually changing it, it's just a smarter way of doing this. This is something you can already do in SolidWorks as well. So if we go back into draft site, I'll just show you how this works. You can choose whether you do this for the whole document or just a selected set of items. So if I just zoom in here, just scrolling in, if you just type in find on the command window and hit return, it says, okay, what are you actually looking for? So inside the bill of materials here, you notice they've got forging and they've got that as a description three times. So I'm going to say, right, anything with the word forging, and you can choose whether it's just in the active sheet that you've got going set in the background, or you can choose the entire drawing set, so if you've got multiple items, or you can choose what's called a selection set. So if I choose the selection set, I'm also going to choose what I want to replace it with. I'm going to set that to casting. And if I click on this now, if I just lasso over this, if I hit return, if I say replace all, you'll notice it's even case sensitive. So I've actually changed it from uppercase to lowercase by doing this. So it's quite a good way of working. Just saves you having to keep double clicking and changing everyone individually. 